Zari Idea Park is conceived as a, a natural respite from the, the hectic and very dense urbanism of central Moscow. And our thought um, was to make a kind of alternate experience that uses nature but doesn't forsake urbanism. Um, it actually has grown out of the conditions around the site. Um, the, the ring road forms a, a, a new kind of border where <clears throat> you'll experience a kind of wild urbanism where we've overlaid um, the, natural, the natural aspects of a park with the hard, uh, hard-edged, dense, urban, architectural elements of the city um, to make a new kind of experience, a wholly new um, experience for Moscow, for sure, um, that is neither park nor city, but somehow hybrid of the two. The, the park is um, conceived as a um, uh, tribute to the people of Moscow and, and, and Russia and the world. Um, most green spaces in, in Moscow have traditionally been very formal um, with, with edges and paths that one must walk on. Um, the, in this park, we're conceiving of it entirely differently. It's a pathless park in a way. So people will be able to put their own kind of experience together um, by visiting the park. Um, it's, it's indeed um, thought to be a kind of um, more of a, of a democratic kind of place, uh, free for everyone uh, and, and opened, open to all to use. We think that this park um, might uh, offer a tremendous impact to the center of Moscow. It will be like a gift to the city, um, something that people had given up on and, and long abandoned hope about will be returned to the city and not just returned as open space, but actually returned as provocative space, a space unlike any public space that's in Moscow uh, anywhere. We believe that this will be a catalyst. The park will be an, an uh, economic catalyst. Um, it will be a social catalyst. Um, and uh, we believe that it will, that people in Moscow will bond over this public space in, as a point of pride um, that the city hasn't seen in a long time. One of the wonderful things about Moscow that, it, that I feel is that the current generation of projects um, are often dedicated to the public. And I think that's a different, a different strategy than has happened in years past. Um, I think Moscow is looking towards other success stories in other cities that have put energy and design into their public realm. And, has, and, and those cities have witnessed great, great growth and, and a rebirth and, and a sense of pride in place. I think Moscow is, is in a way joining that movement, that, that global movement.